The Arc de Triomphe is one of the most iconic landmarks in Paris, France. It is a triumphal arch located at the western end of the Champ Elysees. Here is a brief history of the Arc de Triomphe. Napoleon Bonaparte, the French military and political leader, commissioned the construction of the Arc de Triomphe in 1806 after his victory at Austerlitz. He wanted to commemorate the French army's achievements and honor his Grand Army soldiers. Architect Jean-François de Ries Chaubrin was chosen to design the monument. Construction of the Arc de Triomphe began in 1806, but was interrupted several times due to political instability and lack of funds. The monument was finally completed in 1836, during the reign of King Louis Philippe. The Arc de Triomphe is inspired by ancient Roman architecture, particularly the Arch of Titus in Rome. It stands 50 meters, 164 feet, tall, 45 meters, 148 feet, wide, and 22 meters, 72 feet, deep. The arch is made of limestone and is adorned with intricate sculptures and reliefs. The sculptures on the Arc de Triomphe depict various scenes from French military history. The most famous of these is the bar relief called The Departure of the Volunteers of 1792, also known as La Marseillaise. It portrays French soldiers leaving to fight in the French Revolutionary Wars. The monument is also known for its Tomb of the Unknown Soldier, which lies beneath the arch. The tomb was added in 1920 to honor the unidentified soldiers who died during World War I. It serves as a memorial to all soldiers who have died in France's wars. Over the years, the Arc de Triomphe has witnessed significant historical events and served as a symbol of national pride. It has been the focal point for military parades, state funerals, and other important ceremonies. The arch also offers a panoramic view of Paris from its observation deck. Today, the Arc de Triomphe is a popular tourist attraction, drawing millions of visitors each year. It is a symbol of French heritage and stands as a testament to the country's history and triumphs. The Arc de Triomphe is one of the most iconic landmarks in Paris, France. It stands at the western end of the Champ Elysees and serves as a monument to honor those who fought and died for France in the French Revolutionary and Napoleonic Wars. Here is a brief history of the Arc de Triomphe. Origin and Design The idea for the Arc de Triomphe can be traced back to 1806, when Napoleon Bonaparte, the Emperor of the French, ordered its construction as a symbol of his military victories. The initial design was created by Jean Chalgrin, a French architect, and it was heavily inspired by the ancient Roman Arch of Titus. Construction Construction of the Arc de Triomphe began in 1806, but due to various interruptions, including the fall of Napoleon and financial difficulties, the construction process was prolonged. It was not until 1836, 15 years after Napoleon's death, that the monument was completed under the reign of King Louis Philippe. Symbolic Location The Arc de Triomphe was strategically placed at the center of the Place de l'Etoile now known as Place Charles de Gaulle. This location marks the meeting point of 12 major avenues in Paris and provides a clear view down the Champ Elysees. Commemorative engravings, the monument is adorned with various sculptural and engraved reliefs that depict significant moments in French history and honor the achievements of Napoleon's army. The names of French generals and victories are inscribed on the inner and outer surfaces of the arch. Tomb of the Unknown Soldier, the Arc de Triomphe also houses the Tomb of the Unknown Soldier, which was added in 1921. It serves as a memorial for the unidentified soldiers who lost their lives during World War I. An eternal flame burns at the base of the tomb and is rekindled every evening. Significant Events The Arc de Triomphe has witnessed numerous significant events throughout its history. It was the site of military parades during Napoleon's reign and has been a focal point for celebrations and protests in Paris. It was also the destination for the victorious parade of Allied forces after the liberation of Paris in 1944. 
Restoration and preservation. Over the years, the Arc de Triomphe has undergone several restorations to ensure its preservation. In recent times, efforts have been made to enhance its accessibility and improve visitor facilities, such as the addition of an underground visitor center. Today, the Arc de Triomphe stands as a symbol of national pride and a testament to French history. It attracts millions of visitors each year who come to admire its grandeur, enjoy the panoramic views from its terrace, and pay homage to the brave individuals who fought for France. The Arc de Triomphe is one of the most iconic landmarks in Paris, France. It stands in the western end of the Champs-Élysées and serves as a symbol of French national pride and military victories. Here's a brief history of the Arc de Triomphe. Construction The construction of the Arc de Triomphe was commissioned by Napoleon Bonaparte in 1806 after his victory at Austerlitz. The purpose of the monument was to honor the French army and commemorate their victories. The architect Jean Chalgrin was tasked with designing the structure, which was inspired by ancient Roman arches. However, due to various setbacks, including Napoleon's abdication and the Bourbon Restoration, the construction of the Arc de Triomphe was temporarily halted. Completion and Inauguration Construction resumed in 1833 under the direction of Jean Nicolas Huyot and later Guillaume Abel Bluet. The monument was finally completed in 1836 and inaugurated by King Louis Philippe, who dedicated it to the French armies. The occasion marked the 15th anniversary of the French Revolution and the return of the remains of Napoleon Bonaparte from St. Helena. Significance and Design the Arc de Triomphe stands 50 meters, 164 feet, tall, 45 meters, 148 feet, wide, and 22 meters, 72 feet, deep. It is made of limestone and features intricate sculptures and reliefs depicting various military scenes and symbols. The names of French generals and victories are inscribed on the inside and top of the arch. The monument is also adorned with bronze plates, including the famous La Marseillaise relief, which depicts the departure of French volunteers during the French Revolution.